Hello everybody, welcome back. Jordan here. Today we're going to be doing a bunch of stuff, including some Lego shopping. Yeah, it's going to be good. We're working on a project in the near future for the Lego City, and it requires a new set. So we've got to go get one of these sets here so we can build something bigger and better for the Lego City downtown core. Also, we're going to be doing some other miscellaneous shopping and some other Christmas stuff. We're filming this video on Christmas Eve, which is today. That's why I'm wearing the Santa Claus hat and the ugly Christmas sweater and also on Christmas Day. So if there's some cool stuff happening on those days, which I'm pretty sure there will be, we're going to film that as well. In fact, I just finished building all of these advent calendars that Star Wars uh, Marvel and also City. So let's have a quick look at the advent calendars. We won't review it in detail, but I just want to show you uh, what was included in those three there. On the left side, we've got Star Wars. You get a Stormtrooper, a Tusken Raider, a Mandalorian with the Christmas sort of scarf on, also IG 11, a Scout Trooper, and also Grogu in a pram. Also, a bunch of little mini builds. I like the Land Speeder. Uh, the X-Wing, very similar to last year's X-Wing though, also the Imperial Light Cruiser on the back, and I thought the targets were pretty funny, and that one right there is pretty neat as well, that's uh, Boba Fett Starship or the Slave one. City stuff, you get a bunch of city vehicles, also that train, which I really like, the helicopter, the ambulance, a monster truck, a bus, and then some minifigures out front here, including Santa Claus with a megaphone, a uh, firefighter there with a really neat looking axe, and then a police officer with some skates, and then a thief there with some skates as well, and then this guy right back here with the top hat, which is a pretty cool looking minifigure. My favorite of the three is definitely the Marvel Advent Calendar. This is actually the first year they did a Marvel Advent Calendar. I love all the minifigures that you get with it. You get Tony Stark, Black Widow, Spider-Man, Captain Marvel, I love Tony's sweater there. Also you get Thor, Thanos, Nick Fury, a uh, couple builds of some like robot or sorry uh, suits of armor then you also get the infinity gauntlet which of course was the 24th build you get a great selection of mini builds including uh, the helicarrier the quinjet also the avengers tower with that print piece and then some stuff that's like modular for tony's hall of armor so you get like the little mini suits in the back there with those little mini figures also Dummy, I believe his name is, uh, with the stocking and then uh, the gift wrapping station right here. I like how you get those trophy figures. So there's a brief overview of the 2021 calendars. Let's continue our day. So we just got to West Simmons Mall and here's the Lego store. Look at this. They've added some new sculptures to the top of the store. So right there they have a big brick built tree. I love it because the limb elements are actually like the Lego parts. Look at the flames too. Also there's a firefighter just behind it. Over here we have this guy with his cowboy hat and also a guitar. And look at the black bear right there. <laughs> That's so cool. And then there's like a, what is that? Like maybe a scout or something running away from the black bear? Definitely not a scout. That's maybe like a park ranger or something. Look at the worried look on his face. Oh, that's so awesome. And look at the bear. I love it. That's some great additions. So they're not swapping them up, but rather they're just adding more because the crook on the bike is still there and the soccer players are still way over there as well. So that's pretty cool. I'm stoked on that. Peering down into the Lego store, you can see the 18 plus department. And I really like the look of this Spaceman art. I've got to get one of those because that looks really good. So check it out. We're at West Edmonton Mall with our ugly Christmas sweaters on on Christmas Eve. Crazy. Woo! Are we crazy? We're not crazy. It's not that busy actually. It's not that it's busy. It's not too bad. No. But we'll be back at the Lego store in one moment. We just gotta go do some uh, shopping, check the P.O. box, do different stuff like that. So we're gonna go do some Christmas Eve shopping. So wander. Wander, wander mm -hmm. around, yeah. Yeah. Right on. Christmas Eve, ho ho ho. So it's getting cold out, so we found these coats for our dogs. This one will be for oh. Stella. And this one will be for Deco. Even they get cold in the winter. Look at that, it's got like the Sherpa liner. Oh yeah, they're gonna love it. So we just finished up at my P.O. box. Got something there, thank you so much. Just gave my uh, P.O. box guy a $20 Tim Hortons gift card. We also went to Sport Check because I'm on the hunt for a new snowboard coat and I actually found one 
It is a beautiful coat. Uh, that's Heli Hansen, and it was 40% off. Oh yeah, early Boxing Day special. Not too bad, eh? Actually, this is the first snowboard coat that I've bought in like, I don't know, 15 years or something like that. So I was in dire need of an upgrade. Yeah. All right, we've made our way back to the Lego store. Check it out. We've got the Titanic below the Disney castle, beside the AT-80 -AT Walker Fender guitar, and of course the Home Alone set and Hogwarts icons. Looks like they still have the free promo when you buy the AT-80 -AT Walker, and that, of course, is Luke Skywalker's lightsaber, plus the Santa Claus free gift when you spend 55 bucks. He's skiing. How beauty does that guy look? And he's part of the creator line. So once again, here's the Spaceman art that just looks simply incredible. And I'm really surprised to see the Home Alone set in stock this close to uh, Christmas Day. And I also really like the size of the Volvo and also the cat. Like, this thing is just massive. Might have to try that one day. You know, lots of stuff in stock in all different departments, such as Star Wars and stuff like that. And I really like this uh, Stormtrooper little sculpture that they have here as well. It's pretty cool. All right, so why were we at the Lego store? That's the big question. Well, believe it or not, it was to get another police station. Because like we stated in a previous video, we're planning on adding the big dinosaur exhibit. And in order to build that dinosaur exhibit, you need the police station, the Ideas Fossil set, and also Assembly Square. We already have two of the sets, but we needed a police station to build it, so there it is. I know I should have bought it during double points, but I redeemed $70 for the points today, which is good, and we got this really cool Santa Claus, so not too bad. That guy is super cute, like I love him. He's, he's a beauty, eh? Just say, look at that. Yeah, he's pretty cool. He's pretty sweet, eh? He's pretty cute. So that's why we got it today, to get him. No, I didn't even know this was a thing. I, I didn't even look at the calendar. We are just at the mall here to do some shopping and stuff, and now we're gonna continue our Christmas Eve and Christmas Day. Well, we may as well check out Toys R Us. Check out all these cardboard cutouts. My Little Pony, He-Man, the Monopoly dude, the OMG thing, Pikachu, oh my God, it's Pikachu! Also, Benny, Batman, and a Barbie. Well, we came here to specifically to see if there's any deals, and clearly there is not. So we went out for a Christmas Eve dinner at Olive Garden. I just drove around for 40 minutes looking for some whipped cream. That was hard to find on Christmas Eve at 7 o'clock at night. But Jose's making some chocolate mousse Christmas Eve night. And right now, I'm going to have a sugar cookie. Ooh, I think I'm going to go with the candy cane. Look at Tico and Stella rocking their new coats, eh? Looking styling. Looking pretty styling. Eyeing up that snow, eh, Tico? <laughs> there you go, buddy. Oh, that was rude. You rude, man. You are so rude, man. Proud of you it. are so rude. Tico. Jeepers, buddy. Your sister has feelings too, man. Still. Hey? Okay, let's go. Look at what are it. you doing? You want belly rubs right now. This is not the time. <laughs> like, <laughs> let's <laughs> let's go. We're pretty dang cute. <laughs> Alright, so it's Christmas morning. Woohoo! Merry Christmas, everybody. Amazing. What a year it has been, that's for sure. I'm going to go open some fan mail now because I know some people have sent me some Christmas gifts for fan mail, and what a better day. It's Christmas Day. What a better day. Could there be a better day, is what I should say. May as well open it today. Nice. That's how I wanted to start this morning for sure. <laughs> I just kicked my almond tray with all the pieces in it. No. So yeah, that's how we spent our morning here, unboxing some stuff. Look what we got. No, I'm just kidding. We didn't get an Xbox, but that's what Peter used to pack all of his Christmas gifts. Ooh, thank you so much, Peter. I can't wait to open those and see what's inside. And look at all this cool stuff we got. Thank you, everyone. My family doesn't get me Lego because they think I have too much. So thank you so much for the Lego brickheads, uh, some minifigures. Also, I got myself this puzzle. I thought it'd be puzzling to try and put that together old north sent us this uh the beetle set there Woo, the yellow submarine thank you man and then uh the chocolate from peter as well 
but we got to unbox this for the Shazade. It's it's bright and early, so we're gonna do it uh, later on today, mid Christmas day. We'll we'll unbox that there. So pretty amazing. Thank you, everyone. So it should be a fun, busy day. That's how we started it there with the uh, fan mail. Thank you so much, everybody. My family doesn't get me Legos, so that's it's it's neat. Thank you. It's it's <laughs> I'm blown away. I I can't believe it. Uh, but now we're going to go walk our dogs because we got to do that, of course, right? And then we're probably going to, no, not probably. We will be going to my parents and then we'll hang out with my cousin and his wife and then uh, go to my in-laws. So got a fun, busy, exciting day here on Christmas. Stella, look what I got your mom. It's the most ridiculous thing one could ever get. <laughs> it's a hoodie blanket. Ravenclaw. <laughs> is it Ravenclaw? It is Ravenclaw. Yeah, it's Ravenclaw. It's Ravenclaw. Oh, yeah. God. <laughs> there you go. Hey, check out what Jose got me. It's a Ryobi sliding compound miter saw. Or just a chop saw. Pretty excited about that. Think of the Lego tables that we'll be able to build with this bad boy right here. Woo! So this is what my parents got me and Jose. This blanket here, this Disney book for Jose. Hi Stella, she wants it too, apparently. Some underwear, yeah, yeah, yeah. Also some socks for Jose. A sweater for Jose. Look at this, a Darth Vader shirt, yes. Also a Boba Fett shirt, yes. Also some more socks, those are Jose's. And also uh, this for Jose, just a couple uh, Dry towels there of mini. I know in this vlog we already bought a new coat, but we, my mom got me this here, uh, which is just like a little thin down coat. Here in Canada, you need coats for all different seasons. That's why I have so many different coats because it's cold, warm, medium, all different temperatures. This is a little Reebok down coat. And this is the, uh, the coat that we replaced. Yeah, look at it. It's like permanently dirty. It's got like holes in the arms. It's got... A giant hole right here, multiple holes all over it. It is just a disaster of a coat. So that thing survived 15 years of snowboarding. But yeah, uh, pretty excited to add that coat to the collection. And that's what my mom got me as well. And then I also got these right here. Check it out. Tilly brand slippers. Yes. These things are legendary. They're like, they're like moon boots. Moon slippers, I tell you. Look at that. I was killing Jose off and I was walking around like this all morning with my socks hiked up. There we go. Hey Stella, what do you think? Pretty attractive or what? <laughs> yeah, not a bad little haul from the parents, thanks. Well, I survived Christmas. Yeah, went to the in-laws yesterday. Well, last night, that was fun. Check out my Chewbacca shirt. And my pants, whoa. <laughs> Styling, eh? Check out the other stuff that I got. These glasses here, look at those, Maui Gems. Those things are beauty. Eh? They're perfect. Also, I got three bottles of Iron Brew, Scottish soft drink. I love it. It's so good. Oh, my gosh. I love that stuff. And then uh, a Cabela's gift card. Jose got uh, Sorcerer Mickey, right? Jim Shore. Jim Shore. A few know. little home oh. thingies. Really pretty. Oh, that's cool. Um, little, a little spoon. A little spoon. I like little spoons for whatever reason. <laughs> and then a, a puzzle down things. here. Actually, funny story. Me and my brother opened our gifts to each other at the same time, and we both got each other a puzzle. Huh. So that was funny. I got a pair of sunglasses as well. My dad got like everybody sunglasses. Nice. Styling. Yeah. Not bad, hey Loon? Not and bad at all. And a fancy pot also. Oh yeah. It's, it's like an R place. It's called R place. It's pot. just these fancy saucepans that have sort of just blown up this year. Yeah. They're really very nice. Beauty. All right, so there we go. That's our uh, little shopping trip there at the mall and also our Christmas Eve, Christmas day vlog. Pretty good. Just cleaning up the mess down here now and getting ready to start on some other Lego related projects, including uh, Brothor's penthouse that's going to go on top of the um, 
sitcom tower and uh, we're also getting ready to do some big changes here to the Lego city so we're starting to uh, think about that as well so this is gonna be exciting but yeah there you go I can't believe that Christmas is already come and gone insane how fast time flies thank you so much for coming on by I hope you enjoyed the little vlog here remember to like subscribe and stay tuned farewell